So who is going to be here? Let's find out right now through Alan Roach. Nashville, are you ready for the NFL Draft? It's time to meet your top NFL prospects. From Florida State, defensive end, Brian Burns. We have, believe it or not, guys, come to the halfway point <laughs> of the first round of the draft. Already? Hey, listen, this just for you, Booger. <laughs> Carolina Panthers are on the clock. Let's see where they go. Here's Commissioner Roger Goodell. With the 16th pick in the 2019 NFL Draft, the Carolina Panthers select Brian Burns, defensive end, Florida State. Well, if you want a guy that has bend off the edge, Brian Burns is your guy. Since the end of the season, he knew a lot of people thought he might have been a little too light in the seat, for lack of a better term. Went on a 5,000 calorie a day diet, gained almost 20 pounds, and when he went to the combine, by the way, did not lose a single tenth of speed in his 40 time. He bulked up and was still just as fast. Weight gain, not a surprise, because he was only about 210 pounds coming out of high school. He's a Marvel Comics freak. By the way, end game out tonight, but the draft is better. Uh, does the Spider-Man thing. Speaking of Marvel, let's take a look at some of the things that Brian Burns, like, yeah, there you go. Brian Burns leading the charge. 10 sacks, 15 and a half tackles for losses, Mel, this year at Boston. Get out. 23 career sacks, Dre. You look at you talk about Ben, you talk about Blaine. Socks. Closing speed, obviously he's got some style, bro. Well, without a doubt. Oh, oh. I, I love the fact that we're just going to skip over the main part. He went on a 5,000 calorie diet. How many of us would love to do that? Are you kidding me? <laughs> 5,000 calories. Without a doubt. But, but, but when you look at this guy, you hear the word twitch, Ben, speed, athlete. Is there a concern about the weight? Can he keep it on? I'm sure there is, but that'll come with maturity. Carolina needed an edge rusher. They needed somebody that can turn the corner to go along with K1 Short. When you have the front four that can get after the quarterback, especially in the NFC South, now you can go against guys like Jameis Winston and Matt Ryan. I love this pick for Carolina. Burns is a traditional pass rusher, especially if he can keep the weight up. Yeah, speaking about the front four, look. The Carolina Panthers had the fourth highest blitz percentage in the NFL last year. How come? Because with four, they couldn't rush the passer. And look, hey, I credit that to our stats and research department. It's the best. They're the best in the world. They gave me that stat. I'm just reading it to you. <laughs> this, this makes sense for them, okay? They need juice off the edge. They got it with Brian Burke. Listen, absolutely. And he's been productive every year at Boston College, and now they hope him to be productive in Carolina. Up next, Steve's old team, the Carolina Panthers. With Here's the, the commission. 16th pick the 16th. in the 2019 NFL Draft, the Carolina Panthers select Brian Burns, defensive end, Florida State. Brian Burns was a name I heard come up over and over again over the last week. Teams that were down towards the bottom of the first round were talking about trading up. Some teams early in the draft were wondering how far they could go back and still get Brian Burns. He's got the best get off quickness in this year's draft coming off the edge. The question was the weight. He played in the 220s. He shows up at the combine at 249. And that was a big feather in his cap. The teams were able to get past that weight thing, coach. The guy that people kept saying how light he was when he came out of college was Javon Curse. He's too light, he's too skinny. Is he gonna be able to, to, and that guy showed up and dominated the league. I don't know that this guy's that type of a player, but that's what I kept thinking when I kept watching him. You're, you were 100% right. This guy's got a first step that is beyond anybody else in this draft. It is quick, it is explosive, he is long. You see how thin and long he's built, but this guy can get around the edge in a heartbeat. Spider-Man is his celebration, Kurt. So he just gave you a little Spider-Man there with his hands that on. What that that was, was, that's what that was. Okay. Yeah, I like it. So we are halfway through the first round. The 16th pick was just made. Ten defensive players, six offensive players, three quarterbacks, including Daniel Jones, who the Giants chose with their first of two first round picks. The pick that they traded Odell Beckham for when we come back. And now the next pick is in and back to the podium in Roger Goodell. With the 16th pick 
In the 2019 NFL Draft, the Carolina Panthers select Brian Burns, defensive end, Florida State. Brian Burns, a terrific speed rusher off the edge. Coming from Florida State, first team All-ACC. Second in the country in quarterback pressures with 65 of them last season. This is a really athletic, dynamic pass rusher. Uh, you think of Florida State over the years, you think of great pass rushers, great length off the edge. That's who he is. Runs a 4-5. By the way, that's a 6 Defensive lineman taken already yeah, in the yeah. first 16 picks. Exactly. And also, Bear just shared with me 14 of the 16 picks in the first round yeah. are from three conferences Big Ten, yeah. SEC, and the ACC. ACC. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. wow. 14, 14 of the 16. Of the, yeah. But this guy, yeah, he's yeah. your typical edge Missile. guy. Missile. Yeah, length, speed, everything you want. I think he needs to put a little bit more weight on in the NFL. He did. He put on 21 pounds when he came to the combine, but he probably still needs to put on some weight. That's a yeah. good point. Because he's still rather lean yeah. for a guy coming off the edge. And when you saw him in Florida State when he got there as a pump, as a freshman, he was tinier. He was even smaller, but you're like, that dude gets off the rock like a madman. Speed is there. The counter was there, too. He's starting to learn that spin move. Yeah. I think that's going to be big for him at the next level. Dude, listen. These defensive linemen are getting drafted. The rules keep changing, okay? Right. Offenses, they want to score points. They yep. want These people want fantasy football points. Yep. So you got to get guys that can Dis go get those quarterbacks. Disruptors. Like Disruptors. So that's why it's happening. Yep. Yep. Hey, let's go to the green room now where Tom Rinaldi has a very interested guest in this pick by the Panthers. Stanley, there's been a lot of emotion in this on, room. Baby. Carolina Blue. <laughs> Ain't nobody told me nothing but God. Carolina Blue. I put in that work. Now it's time y'all go get my little brother now. Love you, Carolina. Love you. Thank you, God. You know what it's like to be drafted, to yes. have this moment, have yes. this opportunity. But your emotion on behalf of your brother, how do you describe it? Listen, listen, I went seven round, 237 pick. My brother went first round, 16. I ain't got to say nothing else. <laughs> All you need to say. Yeah. Stanley McClover, uh, McClover celebrating. Brian Burns is a huge fan of Marvel Comics and Panthers hoping he can be a superhero. Is that emotion? So cool.